Hey everyone and welcome to my channel and I'm Alana and this is like an idea video but I will be continuing this so please stay tuned. So what I'm doing is painting. So I am redoing a painting that I did in sixth form. I don't know what um, year, I think it's what I can't remember, it was a few years ago. I like finished sixth form in 2015, so yeah, so <laughs> might sound better. So what I'm doing is repainting one of my works because I don't think it's quite good because I've grown up, been to university and all that, developed my art practice, so I've, I'm redoing this one. This is a, 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 a painting of the church in my town centre. So I can't remember what photo I used for this. So because of the lockdown and all that and isolation, I can't exactly go out and take a photo of it. So I went on Google to search it. So I print off an image so this image is the one I'm going to be using so I didn't look at other photos but I feel like that suited more to what I was going for anyway for what I've already painted so this will be continuing I don't know around to like doing it I don't know I don't know if I'm going to do it today tomorrow but I will be doing it in a few weeks because I really want to get this done and I think because I've developed a lot more as an artist, I feel like I will make it a bit better. But we'll see, because you never know. It might turn out the exact same way. But because I don't want to throw away a canvas, which is perfectly fine, even though it's been painted on already, I will be painting over it. So, yeah, so I don't know when I'm going to go around to do it, but I feel like I might start soon. Don't know when yet. <laughs> might be rambling on, so... See you, see you then. I will be filming as I'm going along with this painting. So this is just like an introduction of what I'm actually going to do. So, bye. This is the image that I have been using and I got this off the internet. So I got this image and this is the original painting that I did in sixth form. And I don't really quite like it to be honest. So I am redoing it. When I was doing a painting outside, I had this little settle with an easel and two tables either side of me. Oh, one mile in fog patches and showers early Friday, but improving to greater than six miles on Friday morning. Stars shining bright above.
One mile in fog patches and showers early Friday, but improving to greater than six miles on Friday morning. Stars shine bright above.
so this is the final video for this um part i like how it's turned out so far i like the colors so far but obviously it needs a lot more detail i'm just putting the block colors in and um, next time i will be doing the more detailed and check if everything's right because i feel like there is still some things that need to improve on like the grey part like it but it's meant to be more diagonal but i will alter this when i paint this piece again so yep i know this video is quite long but i like to see my whole process this is for me as well. I like to see how I came about doing a piece of artwork. It, I have sped it up and where the images have been, it's just to cover up my mum and dad coming into the garden. So, and it's a good reference to the original and the actual image which is shown here in the top left corner. So, I hope you like it and there's some more videos to come. Enjoy. Patches and showers early Friday, but improving to greater than six miles on Friday morning. Stars shine bright above me. Breezes seem to whisper. Second more tree. So, as you can see, I haven't finished my painting yet. Um, I am filming this right now a few days after I painted what I did previously. I feel like I'm going to split up in two parts, like the process and then talk about my final one when I end up finishing it. Because I feel like it's taken me a while because um, what I've done so far, it took nearly two hours or maybe more but yeah because I didn't film all of the process because I was doing it in stages so yeah so so for what I've done so far I feel like it's better than the original one I did at sixth form because I feel like I did it in my first year of sixth form so that was 2013 2014 around about that time so it's been a few years and first i painted it over a bit with white paint because i feel like i needed like a coat over it because i feel like the if i had just paint straight on top it might distract me so that's why you see me painting straight on the white and then I let that dry a bit, but it didn't dry it much. But then I tried to paint the layout with paint first. At first, I was going to draw it out in pencil, but it took a while for the paint to dry. And I thought I'd just get straight to it with putting paint on. It surprisingly worked really well, and I will be doing that technique more, like just drawing the outline in paint first. So... With the white paint, you can still see the um, previous painting below it, but it was like a f it was really faint, so you could see the difference. Because um, 
I use different photos for this but the same building because I don't know what like image I actually used because I didn't I didn't I didn't I didn't, I didn't, I didn't know like what photo I used and where the photo was because it had been a few years and I don't know where my sixth form work is at the moment I need to find it to be honest so I did that then I tried to work in stick parts at the time so I started off the bottom then while that was drying I started at the top and did little bits while each part was drying because I was doing it outside and you can't wait that long for it to dry so luckily the in the end the paint dried really quickly because it warmed a bit up outside for those who don't know I do my paintings outside like with my easel because I don't exactly have an art space at home yet I hope so though <laughs> so luckily it was a nice day it was a bit windy so if you notice my camera shaking a bit and the photograph on top of me easel flapping about it's because it was windy I feel like it started to become a bit windy as I started to paint so it was like typical <laughs> but I stayed outside because it's quite nice it was nice and warm but there was a nice breeze as well so I had like two tables outside of me <laughs> one for my paints and one for my brushes obviously I had like for those who don't like these goo desserts GU it, they come in like glass dishes so I have a lot of them from like having these desserts what I got from supermarkets so I thought because some people do use these for other things so like tea lights put the tea light in and it's a nice glass dish so I use most mostly of the time I use them for like water so I can clean my brushes in so I had about two outside so I wouldn't need to keep on going up and do more so yeah so so far it looks all right so i hope i actually finish it and it definitely looks better so i'm a, after this i will include the actual before and current after so i want you so thanks for watching and i hope you watch the next one for my finished painting altogether because i want to see how much i can actually achieve if you get me <laughs> So thanks for watching, all my links are in the description and please subscribe to my channel and check out all my other videos as well. And if you, I do lots of reactions and art videos so if you are interested in me doing a specific thing or watching a specific thing please put them in the comments. Tell me what you think of it, tell me what you thought of the first painting as well. I feel like that needed more detail because if I had the photograph itself I would just have added that added to it but mostly because I didn't and my art practice has grown I decided to do more more of a better painting to be honest so yeah so thanks for watching please give this video a like and subscribe to my channel and um, yeah so Thanks for watching and I hope to see you soon. Here comes the before and current after. Bye.